If you are in 11th, 12th or have taken a drop year, then this video is for you. Hi everyone, this video is special. I will be sharing 11 advices that are most essential for any student, especially for the ones having PCM or PCB. I asked 6 of my friends for the lessons they have learned in their 2 year journey as a science student and today I will be sharing the top level. Now these people are going to the best institute of the country and even abroad. So sit back tight and make sure to comment down your favorite. Number 1. Take care of your mental and physical health. Sometimes it may happen that you don't feel like doing what you are supposed to do. That is not a condition, that is a symptom of poor mental health. Same with your physical health. The better shape your body is in, the more energetic you feel and the more confident you will be. Second, failure is part of the journey. I can't emphasize this more but you will fail in your journey quite often. But no matter what, you have to stand back. Number 3. Be sincere, not serious. Enjoy when it's time to enjoy and study when it's time to study. I have seen people who have been out with their friends keep thinking about studies and academics. I mean, don't do that yet. When it's time to enjoy, make sure to give you 100% and when it's time to study, make sure to give you 100% to that. Number 4. It's okay to not be okay sometimes. Life is not all happy and charms. Number 5. Choose friends wisely. This is probably the most important. You are going to meet a lot of people in this journey, but what you will become at the end of these two years is directly dependent on the people you hang around with. So make sure you hang around uh, with a good and intellectual crowd rather than the opposite. Number six, consistency beats natural talent. It may happen to you that a lot of people would be smarter and more charismatic than you, but with daily efforts, it's, it's very, very easy to surpass everyone as everyone is so distracted. Number 7. Find a mentor. For example, if you are going to a place for the very first time, you may ask someone for the correct route. In the same way, seek guidance of a mentor whenever you feel stuck. And it will happen a lot, like more than you can imagine. So a mentor could be a friend, a teacher, a relative or maybe a senior. Right. Nothing is permanent. Not even your failure, your sadness, your trouble, your feeling like a loser. If it all go away with time, there will be no right time. You need to create one. Start that new chapter today. Start doing workout from today. Start revising from today. Start giving mock tests from today. There is no right time. Number 10. If you ever feel stuck, start from T equals 0. Just like a problem in kinematics. When you feel lost or disheartened, start from the scratch. Note down the things you have to do and cross the things you can't control. And now the final tip. This one in particular has helped me a lot during my journey. My class teacher told me this in 11th standard that take life as it comes. At times you will feel burdened, pressure for exams, boards, school, parents, marks, friends. But don't overthink. Just take life as it comes. And now bonus tip, you are what you say and think, don't think of yourself as a loser, don't think of yourself as a failure, this is what you tell your mind and your mind acts accordingly, say that you are the best student, you are a topper, you can achieve anything because I truly believe that you can. Thank you for making it this far with the video, share it with someone you might think need it, until then it's Manish Yagi signing off.